Welcome to day 13 of our second week of fasting. And I want to thank you and I want to encourage you. I want to congratulate you for this fight you are in so far. And I'm going to tell you, it is all worth it. By now, you're probably saying to yourself, you don't know if you can finish. I'm telling you, yes, you can, because it's not by might or power, but by the spirit. As long as you stay in the spirit, you can do great things. So keep on holding on. Remember why you're fasting. You're fasting for your family. My challenge for you today is to remind you to take up your position. As we step into this new year, 2021, it's very important that you take up your position. If I may read for you in Ephesians 6 verse 18, it says, Pray all the time. Ask God for anything in line with the Holy Spirit wishes. Plead with Him. Remind Him of your need and keep your prayer earnestly for all Christians everywhere. The passage says, plead with God, remind Him of your need. Earlier we talked about having patience to wait on the Lord and to keep your eyes on the Lord. This is why it's so important. You know, as a new believer, when I started coming to church, I used to think that I'll show up to church on a Sunday morning and I have a great service and not realizing that there's a lot that's been done behind the scene to make sure the service was successful that I can enjoy it. There are men and women who's behind the scene who are working so hard. These people take their position so they can make sure we have a good time. Every job is important and every person is needed to make up the service. And I didn't realize that. But when I started to understand that I have a great role in the kingdom of God. As a soldier, you and I have a specific role in the kingdom. God has given us some marching orders to do, and this is what they are. In 1 Chronicles 16, verse 11, it says, Look to the Lord and His strength. Seek His face always. How are you doing today with praying? How is your spiritual life today? I'm encouraging you to take up your position because God is calling you this year, is your year to take up your position in the kingdom. God is going before you in this Daniel's fast. In this journey, He's with you. He will give you the tools that you need every step of the way. God is your place, is your safety. Take up your position and you will see Him establish you. And you cannot afford not to take a position this year because you are fighting for your family. You are fighting for your future. And God is with you. All you have to know that if you can take your position, take the marching orders and listen to the Holy Spirit, he will be with you. And don't forget to read 2 Chronicles 20, 16 and 17 as we continue to learn in our devotion this week because it is so important that we keep a life of prayer and that's what fasting is about and that's what you're doing right now. Don't worry, it's not easy, but keep on holding on. Remember, as you read this devotion this week, don't just read the Word, but let the Word read you. God bless you.